Before White River Junior Shelby Moore goes for a pin, she needs a PB&J. I, I always say I'm not superstitious, but I'm a little stitious. <laughs> so, so after weigh-ins, I have a peanut butter and jelly sandwich every time. She makes peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. She eats peanut butter on a spoon. There must be some secret to it. Over the past three months, she made 31 peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and was a perfect 31 and 0 with 31 pins. But the secret's not in the jelly or the jam. Shelby is good because she works hard and she had some inspiration growing up. They are best friends. I don't know too many kids like them. And as their mom, it's so incredible to see them have the relationship that they have. Shelby's big brother Nate won three state titles for White River and now wrestles at Northern Colorado. I've wrestled, watched him wrestle since the day I was born, so it's been a long time, but I really uh, admire just how he's so confident. He thinks he can beat anyone in the world, and I think that's what makes him really good is he just believes in himself like crazy. You know, Nathan put a really high uh, bar for his sister to be able to compete and try to win a state championship and follow his uh, footsteps. I try and imitate like his confidence on the mat. The confidence paid off at the mat classic as Shelby went 4-0 in the 130 pound weight division and brought home her first state title. It's just the coolest thing and so for her to be able to replicate something that her brother did it's it, it was really awesome for sure. It, it's hard to explain how much pride you have um, when your kids win a state championship. But a quick glance at Shelby's room will show you she's won more than just a state title. In 2021, during a three and a half month span, Shelby racked up five national championships. Yeah, it's definitely a big realization moment when you're just like, wow, I'm the best in the nation. Like, how did this happen so quickly? <laughs> and Shelby doesn't want to stop there. I'm hoping to make a world team this year in May and hopefully go to the world championships in Rome. Don't forget to pack the PB&J and don't count out Shelby for making an Olympic team one day too. In Buckley, Chris Egan, King 5 Sports.